Epictetus quotes, Greek Stoic philosopher. It's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. Freedom is not achieved by satisfying one's desires, but by eliminating them. Wealth consists not in having great possessions, but in having few wants. He is a wise man who does not grieve for the things which he has not, but rejoices for those which he has. Don't demand that things happen as you wish, but wish that they happen as they do happen, and you will go on well. The greater the difficulty, the more glory in surmounting it. Don't explain your philosophy. Embody it. First say to yourself what you would be, and then do what you have to do. Be content to seem what you really are. Remember that you are an actor in a play of such a kind as the playwright chooses, short if he wants it short, long if he wants it long. If he wants you to play the part of a beggar, play even this part well, and so also for the parts of a disabled person, an administrator, or a private individual. For this is your business, to act well the part that is given to you, but to choose it belongs to another. Don't seek for everything to happen as you wish it would, but rather wish that everything happens as it actually will, then your life will flow well. It is not death or pain that is to be dreaded, but the fear of pain or death. Difficulties are things that show what men are. If anyone tells you that a certain person speaks ill of you, do not make excuses about what is said of you but answer, he was ignorant of my other faults, else he would not have mentioned these alone. He who laughs at himself never runs out of things to laugh at. The key is to keep company only with people who uplift you, whose presence calls forth your best. If you want to improve, be content to be thought foolish and stupid. What concerns me is not the way things are, but rather the way people think things are. What is the first business of one who practices philosophy? To get rid of self-conceit. For it is impossible for anyone to begin to learn that which he thinks he already knows. Make the best use of what is in your power, and take the rest as it happens. No great thing is created suddenly. Caretake this moment. Immerse yourself in its particulars. Respond to this person, this challenge, this deed. Quit the evasions. Stop giving yourself needless trouble. It is time to really live, to fully inhabit the situation you happen to be in now. What would have become of Hercules do you think if there had been no lion, hydra, stag or boar, and no savage criminals to rid the world of? What would he have done in the absence of such challenges? Obviously he would have just rolled over in bed and gone back to sleep. So by snoring his life away in luxury and comfort he never would have developed into the mighty Hercules. And even if he had, what good would it have done him? What would have been the use of those arms that physique, and that noble soul, without crises or conditions to stir him into action? If it is not right do not do it, if it is not true do not say it. Let silence be your goal for the most part, say only what is necessary, and be brief about it. On the rare occasions when you're called upon to speak at greater length, make sure that your words are better than silence. No man is free who is not master of himself. To accuse others, for one's own misfortunes is a sign of want of education. To accuse oneself shows that one's education has begun. To accuse neither oneself nor others shows that one's education is complete. If you want to improve, be content to be thought foolish and stupid. A ship should never rely on one anchor, nor should life rest on a single hope. Thanks for watching.